Have you considered what would happen if the world was locked down and you don't have the necessary items it takes to survive? It might be from a disease outbreak or a war, and as a result of that, you're transported to a camp or a relief shelter where you're meant to wait out the war or the disease outbreak. Do you think you can survive till the war is over or the disease is contained? Or imagine you're trapped on an island after an airplane crash waiting to be rescued. Or you got lost in the mountains during a hiking trail. Do you have the essential items that you need to survive until help arrives? This video is for you. Every prepper must have these items in your home and if possible on you at all times in the case of an emergency. These items are portable, hence they can easily be transported. If you don't have these items, you need to get them now. One, a mini medical kit. A mini medical kit is a cutoff from the main first aid kit you should have with you wherever you go. It is a compact lifesaver with essentials from a first aid kit. Like the name implies, this item is a small box that should contain all the medical essentials to treat minor injuries that you can easily carry about. First aid is important for a number of situations that don't require a trip to the hospital or emergency room. These situations include minor falls, bee stings, burns, allergic reactions, and other common accidents. A first aid kit is helpful for these types of situations, and most preppers should know this. The dangers of a cut left unattended is something that can lead to a major problem like amputation. Leaving something so small as a cut on your skin while trying to survive can lead to an infection. This is why you should always have your first aid kit with you. The minier, the easier it is to carry around. To clean a cut, scrape, or puncture wound, you'll have to use tweezers that have been sterilized with rubbing alcohol to remove any dirt that remains in the wound after washing. A well-stocked mini first aid kit provides you with the supplies you need to be ready for most minor emergencies. This kit should contain supplies like bandages, sterilized gauze, antiseptic, safety pins to fasten splints and bandages, tweezers to remove ticks, insect stingers and small splinters, scissors for cutting the gauze. Your mini medical kit should also contain over-the-counter medications like anti-nausea medicine to treat motion sickness and other types of nausea, anti-diarrhea medicine, pain medications like ibuprofen, antacid to treat upset stomach, and laxative to treat constipation. Your kit should also contain your various allergy medications in the case that your allergy decides to act up in the middle of a crisis. Having a medical crisis while on survival mode wouldn't bode well if you're planning to survive until your certain help is on its way and everything is settled. Two, fire starter. In a world where modern conveniences can vanish in an instant due to natural disasters, societal collapse, or other emergencies, Fire becomes not just a source of warmth, but a lifeline for cooking, purifying water, and signaling for rescue. Having a reliable fire starter is crucial for survival and outdoor enthusiasts, as it ensures the ability to start a fire even in challenging conditions, such as wet or windy environments. A fire starter is a tool or device used to ignite a fire in outdoor settings, such as during survival situations. It is a fundamental tool every prepper should have in order to stay warm, cook food, signal for help, and boost morale when they get lost, maybe from an adventure in the wilderness or when they are camping out. Fire starters come in various forms, including ferrocerium rods, flint and steel, waterproof matches, lighters, and even natural materials like char cloth or birch bark. They are designed to create sparks or flames that can ignite tinder, such as dry leaves, twigs, or cotton balls soaked in petroleum jelly, which then catch fire and sustain the flame. A fire starter ensures access to warmth and shelter. In harsh environments, Hypothermia can set in quickly, leading to serious health complications or even death. With a fire starter, a prepper can generate heat, warding off the cold and creating a safe haven in the wilderness or during power outages. Fire is also essential for cooking and boiling water for drinking. Imagine you're in a scenario where the only available water is unclean and not safe for consumption, and there's no power to use your electric cooker to get clean water. With a fire starter, you can light a fire and boil your water to make it clean for drinking. In addition, fire serves as a vital signaling tool. In remote areas or during search and rescue operations, a well-built fire can attract attention from potential rescuers. This thereby increases your chances of being found. This effective method has saved countless lives throughout history. A fire starter is a versatile tool that can be used in various environments and conditions. Whether it's a traditional flint and steel, waterproof matches, a lighter, or a modern fire striker, Having a reliable means of igniting a fire ensures preparedness regardless of the situation. You can get fire starters on online retail platforms like Etsy, Amazon, and eBay. Three, multi-tool and a survival knife. Versatility is essential in circumstances of survival, 
and a multi-tool shines in this regard. A multi-tool is the perfect tool for fixing gear, making shelters, preparing firewood, or performing first aid. Its varied set of capabilities allows preppers to adapt to changing situations and meet a wide range of obstacles experienced in the natural world or during an emergency. A multi-tool combines a variety of tools into a single compact container. This variety of tools includes knives and saws, pliers, screwdrivers, scissors, and more, all joined into a single practical gadget. This compactness is what saves significant room in a prepper's kit, making sure essential equipment is easily accessible without weighing you down like if you're carrying a whole toolbox. Rather than rummaging through a bunch of different tools, as a prepper with a multi-tool, you may immediately access the essential instrument from your multi-tool and save both time and energy. This simplified approach is particularly essential in high-stress survival circumstances where every moment counts. Survival knives handle a wide range of tasks. Just like the multi-tool, survival knives can be used to build shelter, cut rope, and even self-defense. A survival knife's blade often has a sharp point for piercing, a straight or serrated edge for cutting through materials such as wood or rope, and a flat edge for batoning, splitting wood, or scraping. Some survival knives include additional characteristics such as a sawback spine for sawing through branches, a notch for cutting rope, or a striker to use with a fire starter. Selecting the best multi-tool, survival knife, or combination of the two is a very personal decision. Find a tool with features much aligned with the suitable size and weight of your kit. Four, flashlights. Disasters can strike at any time and in any place. It's always our deepest desire to be safe and ensure the safety of loved ones it's essential to be prepared. A flashlight is one of the most critical items you must have to ensure your survival during situations of emergency. A flashlight is a portable handheld device that provides a focused beam of light. It is an essential tool that is particularly important in low light or dark situations, allowing you to navigate, search for items or signal for help. It is compact, lightweight, and often powered by batteries, making it easy to carry and use. One important use of flashlight is illumination. Visibility is greatly reduced in low light or nighttime settings, making navigation, duties, and even simple activities difficult. A flashlight is a dependable source of light that illuminates the surroundings. In times of survival, you have to have a flashlight in your kit to be able to move securely and identify potential risks should the situation call for it. The illumination of a flashlight provides another advantage when it comes to security. A flashlight enhances security by illuminating dark areas and deterring potential threats. In emergency situations, the cover of darkness can provide concealment for predators, intruders, or dangerous wildlife. A flashlight not only exposes hidden dangers, but also serves as a deterrent, signaling to others that the area is occupied and prepared. A flashlight can also be used to facilitate navigation and signal for help. Imagine a case where you're in unfamiliar terrain during an emergency, and it gets dark and your visibility is limited. A flashlight is what comes in handy in situations like this, whether navigating dense forests, urban environments, or navigating through debris in the aftermath of a disaster. A flashlight helps preppers maintain their bearings, follow predetermined routes, and avoid getting lost. And if you do get lost, you can use the flashlight to signal for help and alert rescuers so you can be located and brought home safe. When shopping for a flashlight, ensure to get one with a high lumen capability and a strong battery capacity and extra batteries in the case that you stay long before help arrives. This is so the flashlight wouldn't run down and you would be able to maximize its potential. Five, manual water desalinator. A manual water desalinator, also known as a desalination pump or desalinator, is a device designed to remove salt and other impurities from seawater, making it safe for drinking or other uses. You may be wondering, how is this item going to help me survive during times of emergency? Quite simple. Manual desalinators are portable, hand-operated devices typically used in emergency or survival situations where access to clean water is limited or non-existent. Having a manual water desalinator in a survival kit can be a lifesaver in emergency situations. In disaster scenarios such as hurricanes, tsunamis, or other natural disasters where freshwater sources may be contaminated or inaccessible, a manual water desalinator offers a means of producing clean water for drinking, cooking, and hygiene purposes. By removing salt and impurities from seawater, the desalinator ensures that you have access to a safe and reliable source of hydration, reducing the risk of dehydration, waterborne illnesses, and related health complications. Being dehydrated leads to a decrease in blood volume and a reduction in oxygen flow to muscles and organs. 
As a result of this, you may experience feelings of fatigue, weakness, and lethargy, making physical tasks more difficult and exhausting. Dehydration can lead to death. This is why this item is important. A manual water desalinator has a lot of other cool uses. For instance, in maritime environments or coastal areas where seawater is abundant but undrinkable due to its high salt content, manual water desalinator provides a reliable source of drinking water. In situations such as being stranded at sea or marooned on a deserted island, access to potable water is paramount for hydration and survival. A desalinator allows individuals to convert seawater into safe drinking water, providing a crucial lifeline until rescue or alternative water sources are found. This device is very much portable and shouldn't be missing from your survival kit. They are lightweight, meaning they can easily fit into your kit and be moved anywhere to ensure your survival. The ease of use of this device means that anyone, regardless of technical expertise, can operate them effectively in emergency situations. As a prepper, this is one item you need and shouldn't be able to do without. 6. Gas Masks Gas masks are protective devices designed to provide respiratory protection against harmful airborne contaminants, toxins, and pollutants. Gas masks are essential tools for protecting against a wide range of respiratory hazards. In emergency scenarios where air quality is disturbed or there is a potential of exposure to harmful particles in the air, wearing a gas mask may greatly improve your chances of survival. Basically, your ability to maneuver and perform in dangerous situations where the air is dangerous to breathe is improved by wearing a gas mask. Wearing a gas mask guarantees that you can continue to breathe safely and maintain mental clarity to assess your surroundings, make decisions, and carry out escape or rescue plans effectively, whether you're fleeing a burning building chock full of smoke and toxic fumes, or heading into areas contaminated by biological or chemical hazards. A gas mask serves as a barrier between you and dangerous airborne contaminants in situations like industrial accidents, chemical spills, or terrorist attacks involving poisonous compounds, preventing intake and absorption into the respiratory system. Respiratory protection against a variety of hazards, such as chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear CBRN, agents, is offered via gas masks. This defense is essential for preventing potentially fatal side effects, such respiratory irritation, lung damage, or systemic poisoning that might occur right away and may be life-threatening if not stemmed quickly. Gas masks offer protection against smoke, dust, and other irritating substances to the respiratory system that are frequently encountered during natural disasters, crashes in factories, or environmental emergencies, in addition to airborne contaminants and hazardous air. A gas mask serves to maintain respiratory health, avoid respiratory distress, and protect your capacity to work and survive in hostile settings by filtering out hazardous particles and toxins. Having a gas mask on hand can assist in ensuring your survival until aid arrives, even in low oxygen areas. This is your cue to add this item to your survival kit, if you haven't already, because it is essential to everyone's survival. 7. Survival Seeds The ability of a seed to produce viable crops with characteristics like adaptability, resistance to diseases, and high yields is what makes it a survival seed. To remain fully self-sufficient, every prepper must have a seed stockpile ready for emergency situations. Stockpiling a variety of heirloom seeds ensures that you and your loved ones have access to fresh vegetables for nourishment and nutrition even when other food sources are scarce or unavailable. Growing fruits, vegetables, and herbs from survival seeds allows you to add to the food you consume with homegrown natural produce, high in antioxidants, vitamins, and minerals, which promotes general health and well-being during an emergency. There is no shame in staying healthy while there is a serious crisis in the country. In fact, staying healthy increases your chances of survival when it comes down to running or seeking shelter. As a prepper, you can reduce the dangers of food shortages, price volatility, and rationing by growing a variety garden using survival seeds, assuring a consistent and continuous food supply for your own consumption and the people you love. When supply networks are interrupted, mobility is restricted, or grocery shops are not accessible, the ability to cultivate your own food becomes crucial for your survival. In addition, survival seeds are useful for economic collapse. How? Purchasing survival seeds provides you with an affordable and feasible means to reduce the effects of food price increase and lessen financial crises. Growing your own food allows you to save grocery costs, expand your budget, and save money for other vital requirements during difficult times. To store these seeds for times of emergency, it is best to get a seed vault to properly stock up your seeds. You can order one on online stores that come with seeds or you can build one for yourself 
by getting an airtight container and a desiccant to ensure low humidity, and then making sure your seeds are dried before placing them into the container. Monitor the seeds on a regular basis for signs of degradation or buildup of moisture. Rotate seeds every few years to maintain viability and prevent genetic deterioration. To ensure ideal storage conditions, replace desiccants as needed. Consider making multiple seed vaults and keeping them in different locations to protect against loss or damage from unanticipated events like natural disasters or emergencies. Tomatoes, peppers, beans, and peas are ideal for seed storing. They feature self-pollinating blooms and seeds that require little to no particular care before preservation. 8. High-Quality Thermal Blanket Exposure to freezing temperatures in emergency situations, such as outdoor survival scenarios in remote areas or natural disasters, can quickly lead to hypothermia, which is potentially fatal. A thermal blanket radiates and absorbs heat from the body, aiding in the maintenance of a stable temperature and reduction of heat loss. This thereby lowering the danger of hypothermia and sustaining core body warmth in adverse environments. Basically, a thermal blanket protects against hypothermia and exposure to harsh temperatures. Its impermeable and wind-resistant features provide a layer of protection against dampness and rainfall, keeping you and your loved ones dry and protected from weather-related damage. This is especially important in situations of emergencies where shelter is unavailable or insufficient. In summary, the usage of thermal blankets in outdoor survival scenarios assist people in staying warm and dry while they await rescue or seek refuge in makeshift shelters. Furthermore, the blanket's reflective surface can aid in exposure and increase the probability of being seen by search and rescue teams, airplanes, or other potential rescuers, even in poor light or bad weather. Imagine an emergency situation where you're stuck in the mountains from an adventure hike and don't know how to find your way down. With a thermal blanket, you can successfully indicate your location and seek aid by creating reflective signs or markings with the blanket. This is why you should have a thermal blanket in your survival kit. With the correct material construction and weave, a thermal blanket can easily compete with numerous layers of linen in terms of insulation. It doesn't hurt that they are quite lightweight. When folded, a thermal blanket is lightweight and portable, making it easy to pack into any survival kit or room. This makes it a crucial survival tool. Most pre-made first aid kits include these, but you may also buy them individually or as reusable pieces to supplement your survival supplies. To use a thermal blanket, wrap it around the body while tucking the sides under the feet to keep the heat in and the cold out. 9. Firearms This is a survival item that is most important in times of danger. During crises such as civil unrest, societal breakdowns, or widespread emergency situations, looters, criminals, or desperate people may pose a threat to yours and your loved one's safety and security. Firearms serve as a deterrent against potential attackers and a way of negating threats, allowing you to protect yourself, your families, and your property from damage. Firearms provide a means of self-defense and protection in chaotic and dangerous environments. Aside from defense, firearms are a valuable asset for foraging in survival scenarios. When food runs out on an outdoor adventure, or traditional food sources become scarce. Firearms allow you to shoot game animals for nourishment and nutrition. Whether it's deer, birds, or wildlife of any kind, firearms are a solid source of protein-rich food to support you and others during long-term emergencies or survival scenarios. Firearms can be used to signify and communicate in distress circumstances, attracting attention and calling for help. As a prepper with a firearm in your survival kit, like a Glock 19 or a shotgun, you can who fire rounds into the air or use weapons to make visual signals that might notify surrounding rescuers, search parties, or other people to your location and request assistance in crises such as being lost in the woods, stranded at sea, or holed up in a disaster zone. However, you can't have a firearm in your survival kit and not know how to operate it. To operate it, you can watch videos on it and practice in a shooting range to get good. It should be noted that in some jurisdictions and cities, a license or permit is required to acquire or possess weapons. Some states and municipalities may additionally compel individuals to register their firearms with the police or another law enforcement agency. 10. Solar Oven This is one essential item that can help during survival cases that no one has but everyone needs. A solar oven is a cooking or heating device that draws energy from the sun. It is often made up of a reflecting surface, such as mirrors or aluminum foil, that focuses sunlight into a cooking vessel, retaining heat within to cook food. It's an environmentally friendly and energy efficient way to cook, particularly in locations with plenty of sunlight. In an emergency, 
Owning a solar oven can be a critical survival gear since it provides a consistent source of cooking heat without the need for power or conventional fuel sources. When presented with natural disasters like hurricanes, power outages, or other events that disrupt normal food preparation procedures, a solar oven has several major benefits that can assist you in dealing with difficult situations. One eco-friendly benefit of having a solar oven is that it operates on a renewable source of energy. By utilizing the energy of sunlight, it cuts out the need for non-renewable energy sources such as fossil fuels or electricity. This is particularly significant in emergency settings, where standard cooking energy sources may be few or unavailable. You can use a solar oven to cook meals even when other resources are limited, making sure their fundamental nutritional needs are met. A solar oven may easily perform a variety of culinary activities, such as boiling water for drinking or sanitation, baking bread, and cooking vegetables. A solar oven provides a safe and convenient way to cook meals that eliminates the risk of fire or smoke intake. In a time of crisis, using open flames or portable stoves indoors can offer serious safety risks, particularly in closed-off spaces or overcrowded shelters. On the contrary, solar ovens use latent solar energy and emit zero combustion byproducts. This makes them a safer option for cooking indoors or in temporary shelters, lowering the likelihood of accidents and respiratory problems. This device is portable, hence can be easily transported anywhere. It is very affordable and can be bought on online retail stores like Amazon. 11. Hand Crank Generator A hand crank generator produces electricity using manual human-powered spinning. It typically comprises a hand-turned handle or crank that spins a generator or dynamo, producing electrical power. Hand crank generators are frequently used as portable emergency power sources in situations where electricity is scarce or unavailable. For instance, power failures camping vacations, or emergency response activities. They may be utilized to charge small electronic devices such as smartphones, radios, and flashlights by transferring mechanical energy from the user's palm into electrical power. In survival scenarios, a hand crank generator can be critical for sustaining the availability of electrical power when standard sources are inaccessible. These small devices provide a dependable and portable method of producing electricity via manual human-powered rotating, a hand crank generator consists of a handle or crank, a rotor, a stator, and a mechanism for converting rotational motion into electrical power. This is how it works. When you spin the handle or crank, it spins a shaft attached to the generator's rotor. With the help of a rectifier, alternating current is then converted to direct current and be used to power your devices. The ease of use of a hand crank generator cannot be stressed enough. These devices are often small, making them simple to move and deploy in various locations or conditions. They need little setup and operation, and as a result, allows you to create power quickly using simple hand cranking movements. This ease of use is especially critical in high-stress survival scenarios, where you may need to obtain electricity rapidly and do not have the time or resources to go through complicated setup procedures. You can make your hand crank generator from scratch or order one from the comfort of your home. Anyway, this item is needed for survival when it comes down to emergency situations. 12. Compass A compass is a navigational instrument that you can use to determine the cardinal directions, north, south, east, and west. This is a crucial survival tool that can help you in situations where you get lost or you're trying to locate a shelter or place. A compass is very important and can help you find your way whether you're lost in the wilderness, stranded in unfamiliar terrain, or navigating through disaster-stricken areas. In emergency scenarios where landmarks are blocked or sight is limited, it can be difficult to maintain a sense of direction without visual clues. A compass uses the Earth's magnetic field to establish a consistent sense of placement. The assistance of a compass allows you to move with confidence even in unfamiliar or featureless landscapes. A compass is a useful backup navigation aid when other technological gadgets or systems fail. During situations such as natural disasters or technical interruptions, GPS devices, smartphones, and other digital navigation tools can turn unreliable or inaccessible owing to power outages, disruption, or damage. In such instances, a compass is a reliable substitute for retaining directional functions. 13. Portable Soil Testing Kit a portable soil testing kit is a compact, user-friendly tool designed to analyze soil composition and characteristics quickly and conveniently, usually in the field or at home. The kit contains chemical solutions in tiny containers housed in a small pouch for easy travel. 
The resulting solutions are applied to a tiny sample of soil in test tubes to determine the pH, nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, and salt levels of the soil. In survival conditions, the ability to grow food is crucial. A portable soil testing equipment enables anyone to evaluate the standard of soil that is suitable for farming. Knowing the soil's pH, nutrient content, and retention of moisture capacity allows you to make more informed judgments about which crops to plant and how to improve soil conditions for optimal output. 14. Protective gear. In survival scenarios where persons may be exposed to hazardous conditions, harsh terrain, or debris, Wearing suitable protection gear can help to prevent injuries and maintain physical safety. Helmets, gloves, goggles, and strong footwear can help protect you against physical injuries, blows, nicks, scrapes, and punctures. Protective clothing and gear are critical for preserving the temperature of the body and avoiding exposure-related disorders like hypothermia or heat stroke. Insulated jackets, rain gear, thermal blankets, and sun caps are essential items for every American citizen to own since they safeguard themselves against severe natural factors in the event of an unexpected disaster. 15. Tactile Pen A tactile pen may not appear to be an obvious survival tool, yet it can play an important part in guaranteeing survival. In emergency situations where vision or communication choices are restricted, Tactile pens can be used to make tactile symbols or markings for signaling and recognition. Imagine yourself lost in the bush or exploring unfamiliar territory. If you have a tactile pen and the other tools suggested in this video in your survival pack, you can use it to make tactile maps or diagrams. This may prompt rescuers to come to your aid. A tactile pen and all other items mentioned in this video can be gotten from anywhere, from your local departmental stores to online retail stores. Most U.S. and Canadian regions will not have enough electricity supply to consistently meet demand during extreme weather events, according to a recent report from the North American Electric Reliability Corporation (NERC), an international regulatory body in charge of the U.S. power grid. A growing number of people in the U.S. and Canada, more than 300 million people, may experience power outages starting in 2024 and lasting until 2028. There are seven must-have items that you need to have available when a blackout happens. 1. Flashlights. Basic flashlights. Let's start with the basics. When the power goes out, you need a reliable source of light to navigate your way through the darkness. Basic flashlights are simple, straightforward, and essential for any emergency kit. They come in various shapes and sizes, from compact handheld models to larger, more powerful ones. Look for brands like Maglite, Energizer, or Streamlight. They're known for their durability and long-lasting performance. Remember to stock up on extra batteries to keep your flashlight running when you need it most. Hand crank flashlights. Now here's where things get innovative. Hand crank flashlights are a game changer during blackouts. Instead of relying on batteries, these flashlights are powered by your own muscle. Just give them a few cranks and voila, instant light. They're perfect for emergencies when batteries might be scarce or when you want to reduce waste. Plus, they're eco-friendly. When choosing a hand crank flashlight, look for one with a sturdy crank mechanism and a bright LED light. Options like the Goal Zero Torch, 250, or the Eaton American Red Cross Emergency Hand Crank Flashlight are great choices for reliable illumination in any situation. Headlamps. Now let's talk about hands-free lighting. Headlamps are a must-have for any blackout survival kit. Whether you're fixing something in the dark, reading a book, or exploring the great outdoors, Headlamps provide convenient, hands-free illumination wherever you go. They're lightweight, comfortable to wear, and adjustable, allowing you to direct light exactly where you need it. Look for headlamps with adjustable brightness settings and long battery life. Models like the Black Diamond Spot Headlamp or the Petzl Actic Core Headlamp offer excellent performance and durability, making them perfect companions during power outages. Remember, Having a variety of flashlights ensures you're prepared for any blackout situation. Whether it's basic flashlights, hand crank ones, or headlamps, make sure to have them readily available in your emergency kit. Two, batteries. All right, let's delve deeper into the backbone of blackout survival batteries. These unsung heroes keep your flashlights beaming and your essential devices humming when the lights go out. Here's a comprehensive guide to ensure you're well-equipped to keep your gear powered up during a blackout. Stock up on different sizes. When it comes to batteries, one size certainly doesn't fit all. It's crucial to have a diverse selection of battery sizes on hand to accommodate the various devices in your arsenal. From the ubiquitous AA and ADA to specialty sizes like CR123A for certain flashlights or coin cells for smaller electronics, 
Having a well-rounded battery stash ensures you're prepared for any power outage scenario. Consider conducting an inventory of your devices and their corresponding battery types to identify which sizes you need to stock up on. Tip. Organize your batteries in a designated storage container or organizer with separate compartments for each size to facilitate easy access and quick identification during emergencies. Rechargeable batteries. Now let's talk about a game-changing innovation in battery technology. Rechargeable batteries. Not only do they offer significant cost savings in the long run, but they also contribute to environmental sustainability by reducing the consumption of disposable batteries. Rechargeable batteries can be recharged and reused hundreds, if not thousands of times, making them an eco-friendly alternative to single-use batteries. Additionally, modern rechargeable batteries hold their charge exceptionally well and exhibit minimal self-discharge, ensuring they're ready to power your devices whenever you need them. When purchasing rechargeable batteries, prioritize reputable brands known for their quality and performance, such as Panasonic Eneloop, Duracell Recharge, or Energizer Recharge. Tip. Invest in a smart battery charger with advanced features such as individual charging channels, overcharge protection, and compatibility with multiple battery chemistries, for example, NIMH, NICD, lithium ion, to optimize the charging process and maximize the lifespan of your rechargeable batteries. By maintaining a robust supply of batteries, both disposable and rechargeable tailored to the needs of your devices, you can rest assured that your flashlights, radios, and other essential gear will remain operational during prolonged power outages. So, take inventory of your battery needs, replenish your supplies as necessary, and consider transitioning to rechargeable batteries for a more sustainable and cost-effective power solution. 3. Portable Charger – Charge Smartphones, Tablets, and Other Essential Gadgets In today's digital age, our smartphones, tablets, and other electronic devices are lifelines for communication, information, and entertainment. During a blackout, keeping these devices charged is crucial for staying connected and informed. That's where portable chargers come in handy. These compact power banks allow you to recharge your devices on the go, ensuring you have access to essential functions like communication, navigation, and emergency alerts. When shopping for a portable charger, look for models with multiple USB ports and sufficient capacity to charge your devices multiple times. Tip. Consider investing in a portable charger with fast charging technology, which can significantly reduce the time required to replenish your device's battery. Look for solar-powered options for sustainable charging. When it comes to blackout preparedness, sustainability is key. Solar-powered portable chargers harness the power of the sun to replenish their internal battery, offering a renewable and eco-friendly charging solution. These chargers typically feature built-in solar panels that capture sunlight and convert it into electricity to charge your devices. They're perfect for outdoor use or situations where access to conventional power sources is limited. When choosing a solar-powered portable charger, opt for models with high-efficiency solar panels and durable construction for reliable performance in various conditions. Examples include the Anchor PowerPort Solar Light or the Goal Zero Nomad series. Tip. To maximize charging efficiency, position the solar panels in direct sunlight and adjust the angle throughout the day to track the sun's movement. By incorporating a portable charger into your blackout survival kit, you can ensure that your smartphones, tablets, and other essential gadgets remain powered up and ready for use during emergencies. Whether you're communicating with loved ones, accessing critical information, or simply staying entertained, a portable charger is a versatile and indispensable tool for blackout preparedness. 4. Non-perishable foods When the lights go out and the fridge stops running, having a stash of non-perishable food items can be a game-changer. Let's delve deeper into the world of blackout-friendly food options to ensure you're well-prepared for any extended power outage. Canned goods Canned goods are the unsung heroes of blackout pantry staples. Not only are they durable and require no refrigeration, but they also boast an impressive shelf life, making them ideal for emergency situations. From hearty beans and comforting soups to refreshing fruits and versatile vegetables, canned goods offer a diverse array of nutrients to keep you nourished during prolonged blackouts. Consider stocking up on essentials like canned beans, such as black beans, chickpeas, and kidney beans. Canned soups, think classic chicken noodle, hearty vegetable, or creamy tomato. Canned fruits like peaches, pears, or pineapple, and canned vegetables, such as corn, green beans, or diced tomatoes. These versatile items can be enjoyed cold straight from the can for a quick and satisfying meal, 
or heat it up on a portable camping stove for a warm and comforting treat. Tip, when purchasing canned goods, be sure to check expiration dates and prioritize rotating your stock periodically to ensure freshness and prevent waste. Snack bars. When hunger strikes and cooking is not an option, snack bars are a convenient and energy-packed solution. These portable and shelf-stable bars are perfect for on-the-go snacking or as emergency fuel during extended power outages. With a wide variety of flavors and formulations available, there's a snack bar to suit every taste preference and dietary need. Whether you prefer granola bars, protein bars, or energy bars, look for options that are high in protein and fiber to keep you feeling satisfied and energized. Keep a stash of snack bars in your blackout survival kit for quick and convenient nourishment whenever hunger strikes. Tip. Choose snack bars with minimal added sugars and whole food ingredients for a healthier option that provides sustained energy without the sugar crash. By stocking up on non-perishable food items like canned goods and snack bars, you can ensure that you have sustenance to keep hunger at bay and energy levels up during blackouts. These blackout-friendly food options are convenient, versatile, and provide essential nutrients to support your well-being when conventional cooking methods are unavailable. 5. Water. Ensuring access to clean and safe drinking water is essential. Here's a comprehensive guide to help you stay hydrated during a blackout. Bottled water. Bottled water is a cornerstone of any well-prepared emergency kit. It's convenient, portable, and requires no additional treatment before consumption, making it an excellent option for immediate hydration during blackouts. When stocking up on bottled water, it's crucial to have an adequate supply for both drinking and basic hygiene needs. Aim for at least one gallon of water per person per day to cover drinking, cooking, and personal hygiene requirements. Choose sturdy plastic bottles with secure caps to prevent leaks and contamination. Examples of reputable bottled water brands include Dasani, Aquafina, and Nestle Pure Life. Tip, rotate your stock of bottled water regularly to maintain freshness and prevent the accumulation of plastic tastes from prolonged storage. Consider labeling your water bottles with the date of purchase or expiration to track their shelf life effectively. Water purification tablets or filters. While bottled water is a convenient and reliable option, it's essential to have contingency plans in place in case your supply runs low or becomes inaccessible during prolonged blackouts. Water purification tablets or filters provide an alternative means of ensuring access to clean and safe drinking water from untreated sources. Water purification tablets, typically containing chlorine dioxide or iodine, are effective at killing bacteria, viruses, and protozoa in water, making it safe for consumption. Water filters, such as portable straw filters or pump filters, physically remove impurities and contaminants through filtration media like activated carbon or ceramic membranes. Examples of reputable water purification tablets include Potable Aqua and Aquamira water purification tablets, while popular water filter brands include Life Straw, Sawyer, and Ketadin. Tip. Before an emergency occurs, familiarize yourself with the instructions for using water purification tablets or filters and practice using them to ensure proficiency and effectiveness. Consider conducting water filtration tests on untreated water sources in your area to identify potential contaminants and gauge the performance of your purification devices. By incorporating bottled water and water purification tablets or filters into your blackout survival kit, you can ensure access to clean and safe drinking water during emergencies, mitigating the risks associated with dehydration and waterborne illnesses. Remember, staying hydrated is crucial for maintaining health and well-being, particularly during extended power outages when access to clean water may be limited. Six, tools to keep you warm. When the power is out and the temperature drops, staying warm becomes essential for your comfort and well-being. Let's explore some tools to help you keep warm during a blackout. Sleeping bags. Sleeping bags are versatile tools for staying warm during emergencies, especially if you need to shelter in place or evacuate to a temporary location. Choose sleeping bags with insulating materials like down or synthetic fibers rated for cold temperatures. Look for features like draft tubes and hooded designs to minimize heat loss and maximize warmth retention. Examples of high quality sleeping bags suitable for blackout survival include the North Face Cat's Meow or the Marmot Trestle series. Tip, store your sleeping bags in a dry and accessible location, preferably near your emergency shelter area. Consider investing in compression sacks to minimize storage space and make them easier to transport in case of evacuation. Emergency blankets. 
Emergency blankets, also known as space blankets, are lightweight, compact, and designed to reflect and retain body heat effectively. These versatile blankets are made from heat-reflective materials like mylar and can provide essential warmth during emergencies. Keep a supply of emergency blankets in your blackout survival kit to use as additional insulation under sleeping bags or as makeshift shelters to trap body heat. Tip. In cold weather conditions, layer emergency blankets with other insulating materials like sleeping bags or regular blankets for maximum warmth. Additionally, consider using emergency blankets to create a blanket fort or shelter in your home to conserve heat and create a cozy refuge during a blackout. 7. Emergency Radio Battery-operated or hand crank radio A battery-operated or hand crank radio is a lifeline for receiving updates and information during emergencies when traditional communication methods fail. These portable radios are designed to operate independently of electrical power, making them reliable sources of information during blackouts. Look for models with AM-FM radio capabilities to receive news updates, emergency broadcasts, and public announcements. Examples of reliable battery-operated or hand-crank radios include the Midland ER-210 Emergency Crank Weather Radio and the Eaton Emergency Weather Radio. Tip: Keep extra batteries or a hand-crank charger on hand to ensure continuous operation of your emergency radio during extended power outages. Additionally, familiarize yourself with local radio stations that broadcast emergency information and preset them on your radio for quick access during emergencies. NOAA Weather Radio A NOAA Weather Radio is a specialized radio receiver that broadcasts continuous weather information directly from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, NOAA. These radios provide real-time updates on weather conditions, severe weather alerts, and other critical information to help you stay safe during emergencies. Look for NOAA weather radios with specific area message encoding, same technology, which allows you to receive alerts for specific geographic areas. Examples of reputable NOAA weather radios include the Midland WR120 and the Sanjian CL100. Tip, program your NOAA weather radio with your local area's same codes to ensure you receive relevant weather alerts and warnings. Place your NOAA weather radio in a central location in your home or emergency shelter where it can be easily heard by everyone in your household. You can stay informed and ready to handle emergencies by adding NOAA weather radios and battery-operated or hand-cranked radios to your blackout survival kit. Recall that during blackouts, information is empowering, and being able to obtain timely information is crucial to remaining informed and safe. How many of these items have you stored already? If the answer is less than half, we strongly advise you to get your hands on some of these extremely necessary items, especially when the chances of having a blackout are rising. Relying on other people for important things like water is not an option. If you have any other items that should be added onto the list, let us know in the comments. Remember to focus on the important things. Keep up with the latest news by subscribing to Financial Flash. It's completely free and keeps you up to date on any emergency situation. Make sure to do the right thing and share this video with everyone in your circle. We can get through the problems this situation brings us together and come out stronger and better prepared than ever. Be careful, stay strong, and stay safe.